guys it's a new monday it's a new week i'm so sorry about my hair i have to redo this anyways um it's almost 12 and i just got ready to head to the gym even though my reservation isn't until 1 15 pm <laughs> but morning i had to like email a few people i'm making br brunch not breakfast and i'm gonna go into the city center in like 45 minutes or something because one of my friends on it's her birthday today so i want to get her a gift i think i know what i want hopefully i'll find it um but i want to do that before going to, to the gym because my reservation is so late but um i really wanted to do a shape class which is at two um so i make the reservation at 1 15. then you have 15 minutes to get in i start exercising at 1 30 and do the shape class at two then i'm done at 2 30 and then I already have the gift so I don't have to do that anymore and I could just shower and enjoy the rest of my day <laughs> so that's the plan Rudy was just about to grab something from the oven with my bare hands It's almost 6.30 p.m. and yes, I'm wearing makeup. That doesn't happen very often, does it? Why is my hair doing this? Um, I said that my friend Anna, it's her birthday today. So I'm gonna go over and have dinner at her house. Um, but I did find a gift. They're little beers and they have her initials on them. And there are four of the those who spell out her name, Anna. Um, then I went to the gym came home, had to call my uncle for something, um, I edited it a little bit, I feel like I did more but apparently I didn't, um, but it still felt like a good productive day, got everything done that I needed to get done today, so that's good, I'm now heading over, I think we're having nachos, it's gonna be like a nacho table, so I'm really excited. <laughs> It's a Tinder party. <laughs> Why is this happening? That's not supposed to happen. I'm scared. Hey friends, it's Tuesday. I look bald. It's already 4 p.m. I spent the entire day editing last week's vlog, which I just finished. It's a long one, but now my computer is like glitching so that's not a good thing i need to go to work in an hour but i also want to go to the grocery store so my laptop needs to like hurry up so i can save this while i'm doing my grocery shopping and hopefully i'll be back on time today has been a little hectic i did everything i needed to get done today and more i wanted to do laundry tomorrow but i did it today instead finished a very long vlog did my groceries just in time because i need to leave in like three minutes everything just went wrong i have this little alarm on my keychain i bought it not too long ago because one of my friends has it just in case you might get attacked in the middle of the night outside and you pull the thing and it starts making a horrible noise but mine isn't that great it fell off a couple of times and then the alarm went off in a normal situation so people looked at me like are you okay <laughs> this just happened when i tried to get my bike and then it also happened in the middle of the grocery store <laughs> i just took it off my keys this is not working properly um that's not supposed to happen but <laughs> then also my package of oatmeal just ripped i stood there at the self-scanning thing and i was like uh why <laughs> and then i wanted to pick up a package at another store 
but I forgot about it on the way and I had to cycle back. He said the package wasn't there, then he checked again, it was there. It was actually supposed to be dropped off somewhere else, but then they didn't give me a code for the machine, so they dropped it off at that store. Glad it's there, I'll show you tonight. There are two pairs of jeans from Zara, I hope I fit one, because I saw one of my friends post an Instagram story of her friend wearing those jeans, and I texted that friend of hers girl those pants you're wearing today where are they from <laughs> even though it sounded really stalkerish but she came through with the link and everything that's what's up sweating also got a new bank account bank account bank card in the mail and one of my friends yesterday gave me an advent calendar and i haven't had one of these in a million years i'm excited to eat a chocolate tonight can't believe it's december let's go to work also the netherlands finally decided to um, make masks mandatory only like eight months into this pandemic but you're not obligated to wear them in public settings so or public spaces so the public transport was already um, it was already obligated but now it goes for stores gyms etc finally Hey guys, I haven't talked to you in a bit. I still look like an egg. It's um, actually Wednesday, 8 p.m. Yesterday I worked a shift from 5 until 9.30 and today I worked from 1 until 6. Today was so cold, <laughs> um, but it was fine. I'm really tired though and I'm so sore from the gym for Monday. I also took out some trash this morning. I cleaned my shoes and I prepared a bag. Tomorrow I have some kind of interview or meeting for a new job or an extra job. Um, I don't think I can say too much about it. So yeah, tomorrow I'm going to The Hague and catch a train. Um, right now I'm gonna FaceTime my friend Omi and we're gonna watch the Shawn Mendes documentary. We haven't done that yet. So I'm really excited to see her and to see Sean. I'm also excited about these. Number two. I can't believe it, guys. It's going so freaking fast. Chocolate is always appropriate after dinner. Cheers. Ah, <gasps> yummy! Exciting. Exciting. No, I think we'll be together. Think that they will come out. Cause you're Wow. Good morning. <laughs> Got my rental bike. Let's go. I've been back home for a while after that meeting thing I had some tea at my uncle's house who live in The Hague and then I took the train back home I wanted to go to the city center but it was so cold it still is it's raining and yeah it's just sad it's now almost 6 p.m. I've been home for like two hours now I'm going to the grocery store usually I go to the Albert Heijn which is my favorite now I go to the Jumbo because I need something, Apostrophe, the best version of that they don't have at my store, so we're walking there. I just got an email saying someone wanted to buy something off me of Vinted, and I put stuff on there like maybe two months ago. Someone is buying my bad hair day beanie, which I never wore except for like pictures. It doesn't fit my face, or my head, or my hair. I don't know where the number three is. Zeg maar de cijfers zijn wel super moeilijk. Ja. Vooral hier. Ja. Ja. Negentien. Oh, drie. Nee. Wow. Oh, it's a hotje. Woo. Die ziet er lekker uit. Het is. 
Oh, marzipan. Marzipan with orange flavor. Oh, that's phenomenal. Disgusting. Can't orange and chocolate. Nee, shouldn't be in combination. Good morning. There's a lot of blueberry. <laughs> Hello guys. Speaking of Sean, I didn't really like the documentary that much. I felt like it was more a documentary about Sean and Camilla. Yeah, I mean, it was nice to look at, but I don't feel like I experienced or learned something new about him. So yeah, I wouldn't not recommend it but i wouldn't be like yes go watch it now so yeah <laughs> i'm off to work now <laughs> goodbye people i haven't talked to you in a bit sorry about my hair and my face um it is what it is today i did an x -core class again with natasha very sweaty um before that i actually went to zara to return one of the pens i'm keeping one i'm really excited about them but they're kind of short but i think i'm gonna work it somehow so i did that then went to the gym then afterwards i sent a package. Someone actually bought something off my Vinted for the very first time, so I went to this post office thingy, sent the package, and I added some candy in there because I was just really happy about this first seal. I came home, I chilled for a while, eventually took a shower and cleaned the bathroom because that was my task for this week. Faced my mom, did laundry, and now I'm making dinner, which is gonna be slightly random, but I'm still very much looking forward to it because I'm hungry. It's already 8 p.m. <laughs> so for dinner, I made myself a pizza wrap or quesadilla because I'm lazy and this is easy to make and I love it. And usually I dip it in some cream cheese. This time I'm dipping it in guac. And now it's even more a quesadilla situation. And then for um, dessert, we got some blueberries. And I'm gonna start on Dash and Lily. I finished Grand Army yesterday I wouldn't recommend it. I thought it was so slow and I didn't even want to finish it, but I hate starting series and not finishing it. So I had to pull myself through that one. I didn't like it. I thought it was really... Yeah, every scene just took way too long. It, and I felt like this show wanted to be what 13 Reasons Why it was, if that makes sense. I know there's a lot of people who hate 13 Reasons Why. I love that. And I didn't like this, so maybe for the people who didn't like 13 Reasons Why, they'll like Grand Army. <laughs> oh, also, I thought the audio in um, Grand Army was really off. Like, every scene that was a little serious, they spoke really quietly. And then one scene after, there was super loud music. It just didn't make sense. Every time they were talking, I had to put up my volume, like, all the way up. So, that's just a little annoyance thingy. <laughs> I was just at work. I worked from 11.45 until about 8.15, so eight and a half hours. I'm so tired because oh, my legs are pretty bad. And I know the moment I sit down, I won't be able to get up. So I just wanted to say bye because I don't think I'm gonna do anything else except for watching some more episodes of Dash and Lily. I like it so far, it's cute. Tomorrow I have to work quite early as well. So I'm not really looking forward to that. But since it's the end of the week, it's the end of the vlog. I hope you enjoyed, even though I have no idea what happened this week. I feel like this week went by so fast. 
wait i did some exciting stuff this week <laughs> um but yeah i hope you enjoyed if you did please give it a thumbs up and subscribe it's completely free and i'll see you on my next one bye guys